hey guys welcome to my channel so this reading will be for those who have cancer as their sun moon venus rising north node or if you are dealing with a cancer okay i do pick up the other person's energy at times so please keep that in mind if it doesn't resonate with you it's likely that's how your person's feeling if it doesn't resonate at all please check your other placements and um this reading is not for everybody it's a general reading so it will not resonate with everybody please keep that in mind Honestly, um, <clears throat> didn't want to like dampen the mood with you guys read, but like there's some people out there, like just in the world, let's talk about like social media. If something doesn't resonate with them, they're like, that's not me. I don't even speak to my, like, I got the most ridiculous message and I was like, hold on, it's general. It's not a personal reading. It's not a private reading. It's not going to resonate with every single sign and how they react shows a lot more about them than it does about me so um i'd really keep that in mind before you comment and i haven't really got that no i haven't got that at all with cancers you know you guys have been very respectful and stuff but it was actually the aries reading i was just like it's not going to resonate with everyone well actually youtube deleted it before before i even got a chat well i wouldn't even respond to be honest because you know it's just ridiculous but it's not going to resonate with everybody okay guys all right something's come out let's see what it is sorry about that but i had to say it it's not it's a general reading it's not a private reading okay all right five of wands <laughs> yeah five of wands and karma in reverse okay guys so i feel like Something that you've been, um, okay, I'm getting that something that you have been wanting that you is actually like you're competing for something. It could be, I'm not sure if it's like in your career, um, hopefully not in a, in, in a relationship. Because no one should have to compete in a relationship, you know. But I do feel like there's some kind of... Um, ah, okay. I'm getting some kind of jealousy. So someone's kind of jealous of the attention that someone's receiving. Listen. Uh, hmm. Calm it. Oh, oh, God, here we go. It's love. It's to do with love. Three of pens, three of cups, three of cups, ace of wands. Part of me doesn't want to do this reading, but this is what come out. So this is what needs to be spoken about today. All right. So oh, these are a bit. That's turned around as well. Okay. So um. Yeah, I feel like there's there's some kind of third party situation. There could be somebody who's either in your energy that wants to get your attention or your person's energy that wants their attention. I'm not sure if it's a new person or a past person, but um I do get this kind of attraction. Um I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. The full. Mm. I'm getting that someone has um taken a risk. Somebody's um. I'm getting that somebody's taken a risk with with a with a different person, and someone else feels foolish, like for competing for this person who's going elsewhere for someone else's attention. I don't know if. This has been done already. If somebody's thinking about this, it's going to be different, okay? Everyone's in different timelines. But um, I did pick up with the first card. I don't like it. Um, maybe this is why you've left somebody. Maybe this is what you're going through right now. Page of Swords. Yeah, I feel like someone's keeping an eye on their person. Whoever the one is doing the whoever the innocent party is i feel like they're the one who's keeping an eye on their person and the other person i am getting them like checking their social media and stuff like that and 
you know, or checking someone's phone and eight of pentacles. You guys are like detectives right now. You're working hard. You're like, <sighs> oh my God, stop. No, that's no. All right. What I just got is like when somebody comes home, like whoever thinks, whoever's doing the cheating or whatever, or whoever thinks is that person's doing the cheating is like, when their person comes home they check their clothes they're checking things for evidence like lipstick you know different smells of perfume um just different scents certain certain things someone's like turning into detective mode some of you might be dealing with a scorpio or you might have scorpio in your chart or you could be a libra as well you guys would make if if you are a cross watcher and you have those placements or you are a scorpio or libra you guys would make good detectives or FBI agents or stuff like that. Ten of Pentacles. Two of Wands. Mm. All right. For the for those who are married, because this is a very specific like read it's not going to be for everybody but for those ones that are married um i feel like you guys will um you will get some money um like who, the ones who are getting divorced i'm sorry i don't like these kind of reads guys i'm not gonna lie i don't like them three of pentacles you may be, uh, whoever the innocent party is, I feel like you guys may be um, going to see a solicitor, a lawyer, or somebody who's gone down the same route as you, who's been through the same thing, and they, they are, you're asking, you know, what should I do? What's the next step? So my head's getting on my nerves. What the next step is, like, how should I go about this? Um, trying to gain information, yeah? Please tell me about cancers. What's come up? All right. So we have. Wow. So we have the five of swords in reverse. The shadow work in reverse. So maybe you guys don't want to um continue fighting for this anymore. I feel like at some point you guys will, um pull back your energy you, you will stop fighting for this especially you know some of you guys if you are fighting it'll be for this divorce for you know for you guys to like get away from this person or if it's not a divorce it's like okay well i'll keep the house you move out because you did the dirty like i did nothing wrong you need to leave yeah that kind of thing someone's not doing the shadow work i feel like it's like do you know what i'm not gonna lie i am getting this both sides because I feel like some point cancer, either you or your person, I'm not sure, and, you know, don't shoot the messenger, yeah, is, is, I have to tell you what I feel, but I do feel like at some point you have, you've kind of held on to this person tightly and hoped that they would stop their cheating line ways, and that was you kind of like not keeping your promise to yourself, that you would put yourself first, that you would make sure that, um, you know, you wouldn't allow somebody to drag you down or make you look silly or you know say like you're doing shadow work and stuff like that because it has come up that has come out in the reverse it's like you haven't kept that promise to yourself and it's like you've this person's low vibrational and they're even if you do really love them it's like it's like okay i love them so much i love them i want to make it work but you know they're 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 being a piece of shit right now and i'm gonna say it how it is yeah and you're putting energy into that, you put energy into it, and this person ain't, they're not giving you the same thing back, and you know that you're worth more than that. So I feel like on both sides, shadow work needs to be continued, and to, needs to be done, and um, I do feel like if it is you cancer the one that's an innocent party, I feel like you will do it, but obviously you're going to feel hurt and betrayal and all those things first, and hopefully it will push you to to um remind yourself how much how worthy you are of things and how much that you how much you do deserve and what you don't deserve what you don't want and to make sure that you create those boundaries and don't allow other people to cross them and when they do cross them then you walk away yeah 
six of swords see it's like staying in that in that same situation upright that's like mental health card yeah it's like moving away to calmer waters for your own mental health and upside down yeah in reverse is like not doing that it's like you know that it's, it's damaging your mental health you're keeping in that situation it's the ego it's it is the ego it's like oh but i love them oh but i want them oh but i and you your higher self is like cancer you know we're showing you who this person is this person is showing you who they are i don't know if your person knows that you know if you told them already six of that that there's that you be that, that they've been given to someone else yeah so the six of um pentacles has been stressing you out it's been stressing you out that's some of you guys just want to lock yourself away because you're just like so heartbroken over this thing and i'm so sorry it's not the kind of route that i want to give you guys I, but i can't help that i i can't i have no um control over what comes out oh the bottom of the deck was five of five of cups yeah yeah i am getting disappointment like you guys you know you guys you guys could have really loved this person and stuff but there's something better out there for you and you know what i did actually say that in my last reading for you guys i did say that i liked your future person much better so if you have watched this if you are still watching the uh, video this reading please watch the previous one okay that may resonate with you especially if you're going through this um yeah advice for cancer advice for cancer please what's that nine of wands if this person's hurt you physically you need to get away if if this person makes you self-sabotage like not makes you because obviously only you can do that but if this person makes you doubt certain things and you know it's constant like you know you, your intuition is very strong cancers man your water sign like you guys are very intuitive so i would definitely um trust what you're feeling yeah trust your gut instincts death in reverse might give you guys another read not straight after this one but like at some point i might give you another read because yeah I, I just i don't like it aries taurus and gemini's reading was was really quite uplifting and then this one's completely switched up so obviously all different signs yeah nine of swords in reverse I You guys are really avoiding something you guys are like holding on i'm getting you guys like really hold oh my god cancer if you guys have studied astrology and stuff like that you'll 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 know that it is difficult for you guys to um to let go you know like if you've been with someone for a long time and you're just comfortable i just i feel like there's something better out there for you i really do feel like that please watch the other reading like the last reading that i've done for you guys It's nothing to be scared of somebody will love you and appreciate you and this person is not i don't know who it is but <sighs> guys i'm sorry it's made me feel all down okay guys i'm gonna leave it there um i'll see you guys in the next reading